most of us use continuous improvement and continual improvement terminologies interchangeably but they are distinct and unique terms my name is kevin kuto and in this video i am going to simplify the difference between continuous and continual improvement for you if you like the content consider subscribing and liking the video so that we bring more such content for you now let's begin with our first term which is continuous improvement a continuous improvement is an ongoing or non stop efforts in development of services processes products or our self development in continuous improvement next improvement activity begins the moment the first gets over without any pause as shown here so we have time and improvement and as you can see this is continuous in nature kaizen is a form of continuous improvement so what is kaizen kai means change and zen means good in kaizen we identify an area of improvement and we keep on improving it on daily basis little by little to make it better than previous state lean manufacturing or kaizen aims to improve efficiency within an organization by eliminating waste or non value adding activities in the process and reduce the defects by taking actions every day in personal life if you want to learn english you can keep on building your english vocabulary every day and it would be continuous improvement in your personal life the second term is continual improvement a continual improvement is a repetitive and phased approach with a pause in between two consecutive phases to measure and analyze the success so that we can do further improvements based upon our learnings before we move to the next phase like our product development cycle is divided in many phases and we have reviews after every phase to analyze the success of the current phase we intend to learn from the current phase and do better in the next one so there is a pause between two phases of product development we also follow continual improvement in our academics where we have divided our education in multiple phases in multiple semesters we stop and analyze the success of every phase through the exams we learn from the results and improve as we proceed to the next phase now continuous approach could be go 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 approach without any pause in between whereas continual approach could be start stop start stop approach where there are pauses in between to measure and analyze the results most of the quality management system standards like iso 9001 2000 or iatf 16949 vouch for continual improvement and it really makes sense to take a pause learn and improve after every phase right so i hope that now on you will always use terms like continuous and continual improvements in appropriate context thanks for watching see you in the next learning video